Hello and welcome back. You are game with me, Brothgar. Today I have some more loadout outfitter action for you. And I tell you what, it is actually not doing weapon crafting, so it is a little bit of a different video for me. But I recently spent a few dollars here on the game itself, got myself this Steam package, and I'm going to upgrade my look here in loadout. As you can tell, I have some space bucks and I've already spent them. So let's head on over to the outfitter and see what I have in store for you today. Obviously, I like playing as Axel, and if you've been watching my videos for, I don't know, what is it, like 42 videos now? You'll know that this is basically the look that I have been sticking with for such a long time, and I kind of felt... I started to feel kind of bad because I was making all these videos, but I never really had anything unique. But I got a cool thing that I got to show you. Razer actually came out with kind of a package deal. They're trying to promote their comms device, which I personally haven't used, but I'm actually quite interested in actually trying it out. And as you can tell, I already have a Razer Black Shark headset. So to me, it really kind of fits. It's all together. I'm actually not sponsored by Razer. I'm not sponsored by Loadout. I'm just playing the game. So I'm going to actually show you how to actually get this t-shirt for free here once I show you my full getup. So the t-shirt itself is right down here, the Razer t-shirt. And you got to admit, that looks pretty good. I like green and black. I'm a big fan of their logo. And I, you know, it looks impressive and it's unique. I haven't seen a lot of people using the Razer t-shirt itself. Now, as far as the jewelry goes, I'm going to actually take the dog tags off just because I don't really, I don't feel like they have anything to add to the outfit. Now, all in all, to me, I'm kind of liking that. I mean, at least it's a little bit different, something a little bit different than the beta t-shirt, which I got by participating in the beta in case you didn't already know that. Um, as far as that, I wanted to customize some things and I had some space bucks to spend, so I decided I want to go with the base black pants. So I'm just kind of changing the color up there and I thought, you know what, that looks pretty good. And I actually forgot to take that little unit off the pack chair. This is the magazine rig and I kind of left that on there, a little sneaker, but that came from the actual steam package itself. So there's that. And as far as the belt is going to go for my character, I decided to go with the grenade belt because it just matches. So now everything's nice and black and the belt itself is black. So to me, that actually looks pretty cool. But there's some icing on the cake. There's a little bit of icing on the cake and I thought, what could I put on my character that would look good? Now I got the steam punk goggles that came with the steam thing. And I'm like, you know what, that's okay. But the color scheme doesn't really work for what I'm going for. So I decided to spend, I know, 5,000 space bucks, or just about 5,000 space bucks, on probably the coolest goggles in the game. That is the night vision goggles. Now I gotta take my mask off here in order to see it, but yeah, check that out. So that is the new look for my character here in Lodo, and I gotta admit, that is pretty awesome looking. I'm a big fan of it, and I'm actually quite glad that, you know, like, Razor decided to offer that t-shirt, because I tell you what, that t-shirt makes this whole thing kind of unique and pretty awesome. So, how do you actually go about getting this Razor t-shirt? Well, you have to make an account for the Steam comms, and then you're going to come over to this website, which I'm going to show you just in a second, and then you're going to just basically put your comms account in there, and they'll give you a code to receive your t-shirt. All right, so this is the website you need to actually plug in your Razer comms account. Now, what exactly is that? Well, it is basically Razer's edition of TeamSpeak or Ventrilo, and I personally haven't had the opportunity to really test it out, but I do have it, and it does look like it's got some neat features. I mean, it even works on an Android phone, so I'm thinking that there's probably some pretty good potential there for being a pretty neat comms like utility. However, once you have that account, which is absolutely free, you just need your email or whatever, what you're going to do is come up here and plug in your info. So it'd be your email at whatever.com plus your password, and then you're going to get a code. Now, where do you go put this code? All right. So now that you have your code, what you're going to want to do is take that code, come on over here to store, click redeem code, and then you're going to type it in there. Click OK, bada bing, bada boom. It'll tell you it's approved. And then you can go into your outfitter and put on your new T. All right, so there you have it. That is all it takes to get the Razer t-shirt here in Loadout. So if you found this video helpful in some way, shape, or form, or just plain enjoyable, make sure to hit that like button on the way out. That's going to help me support my content. The comment section is below. And if you haven't subscribed already, make sure to hit that subscribe button on your way out because I do this stuff on a regular basis. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace. Brothgar out. 
Now, first off here, as you look at the packaging, you could tell it is definitely nice packaged, packaged to fit for its price range. I mean, they have the nice display there, the graphics match and whatnot, even as you go around back. And as you open up the package, you even get greeted with nice little graphics on the inside. So it's kind of like an experience as you go through it. I mean, all in all, everything is in a really good place and it seems very secure, something like it's not going to get damaged as it is shipped. So obviously the packaging is very good, but how is the product? Well, the product, in my mind, is absolutely cool. I mean, check it out. I mean, this is probably, to me, one of the coolest looking headphones.